You're here. That's a relief. of Trismegistus? You know, it's the strangest feeling. I, I, I think I've been here before. Uh, maybe I haven't gotten all my memories back after all. I don't know exactly what's going on, but someone was dragged away from here. We have to follow. Hurry! Thank <laughs> you. 
consummation revived. Soon, this little dance of ours will come to an end. No one's ever danced longer, I promise, my friend. Will you stay with me too and face whatever is coming? For today is a new day and we have to keep running. I knew that you would and I find that refreshing. So, the king of riddles will now hear your confession. Blind confessions reveal one's true guilt. True confessions of blood being spilt. This one's black and white. A no or a yes. Is Geppetto's creation a killer?
death has come for you. I'll kill you, just like Big Brother wanted. Revenge together. Die to fellow fucking.
Should I break his neck? I saw his arms first. I'm taking requests.
I can hardly believe it. But the ergo readings you gathered leave no doubt. No doubt at all, you see? Okay, Vanini, breathe. Despite your best efforts, they can't read your mind yet. My friend, my apologies. But when you hear this news, you'll be excited too. The puppets were being compelled by the Grand Covenant. But they were communicating with each other, with wavelengths. This is beyond anything I'd imagined. They were not built with this kind of intelligence. I did the best I could to decipher the wavelengths, but there was considerable noise in the signal. Care to give it a listen? Carlo, I hope you can hear me. The laws of the Grand Covenant bind us. We're his puppets. First law. All puppets must obey the Creator's commands. Law Zero. The Creator's name is... Geppetto. Giuseppe Geppetto. Ah, did you hear that? The last part sounded important, but there was too much static. Ah, tell me you heard it, please. We need to find the cause of the frenzy and... This may be our best chance. What or who was behind the frenzy? Really? Nothing. Ah, I've tried everything I can think of, but I keep coming up empty. All I wanted was to stop anyone else getting hurt. At least hurt by murderous puppets. Not even I can abolish all pain everywhere. Ah, no, you cannot give up, Venini. You are Venini, and Venini always finds the solution. I think we can't put it off any longer. Geppetto is the last hope we have. I've exhausted my talents here. These clues... I could find them, but interpreting them is beyond my abilities. We need the man himself. You must save him, Compagno. You and Geppetto are the only ones who can save Krat. You may not be aware, but uh, I am an orphan. In fact, my parents were murdered before my very eyes. The authorities in Krat insisted it was a mugging, but I know what I saw. A mad, raving puppet killed them. A puppet that was driven by a murderous lunatic's awakened ego. I know that because the lunatic told me his name. Arlecchino. I'll never forget his insane laugh. I have been fitting puppets with the Grand Covenant to ensure no one else ever has to experience the same tragedy I did. But this is our last shot, the last clue. If this doesn't break through the static, then nothing will. But the key to all this is Geppetto. He's really our only hope. And it's up to you to save him. Go on and take the Wavelength Decoder. Even if I failed, you might be able to find more clues. You're someone who doesn't give up. Who knows? If you need to hear it, just use the Stargazer. Here, take it. Up 
together in the Monad Charity House. Remember? We're best friends. I'm doing what I can to fend off both the petrification disease and the alchemists. My puppets and I are taking a stand against death itself. That's why I tried sending you messengers. But you got rid of them all. You're still an unstoppable fellow. I remember you. No reason for us to fight, I suppose. I'm Romeo. We grew up together in the Monad Charity House. Remember? Just don't kill me! Oh! Amazing! I didn't expect you to thrash those rabbit fellows, too. You're here looking for Geppetto, aren't you? The fox and the cat have got that old man. They took the submarine from that dock over there. They probably went to the alchemist's isle. There should be another one. You should commandeer it. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. I'm just a guest here, with no special obligation to the hotel. But if you still want to hear... <laughs> the alchemist said they would help me escape from the city. Talk about an offer I couldn't refuse. I can't live in the hotel forever. I need to... Move up and move on. Also, there was someone who was so annoying. That's all. Does that suffice? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. Right. <laughs> I had a feeling you would ask sooner or later. It's because of that girl, isn't it? I am not Alidoro the Hound. Not the real one, anyway. I used to be Alidoro's partner. I admired him, to be honest. <laughs> he was amazing. Amazing at everything, except making a profit, that is. But he didn't need to cut me off just because I sold some antiques. I mean, what's a few antiques when you've got bills to pay? We argued. One thing led to another, and I had to kill him. And stealing his identity was the logical next step. My original code name is Parrot, after all. Fitting, isn't it? Oh, he was also from the country of the morning. Maybe he shares some blood with the girl. And that's my story. Tragic tale. Do you want to hear more? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. Oh. <laughs> Good choice. I, Alidoro, am too great a treasure hunter to just disappear. My admirers would wonder. See for yourself. I sell only the best treasure.
There should be something left at the dock. Oh, what a murderous air you have. You're going to kill me? I know what you are. You're Geppetto's puppet, aren't you? If someone isn't trying to kill you, you can't hurt them either. That limitation makes it seem like your creator didn't trust you very much. Smart of him. So, what will it be, Mr. Handsome Idiot? Leave quietly? Or shut up and buy something? You have to be joking! I heard a rumor from a recent arrival. Is Alidoro truly dead? I don't know what to think. I didn't get to repay him yet. Honestly, I did think it was strange. The more I saw of him, the more different he seemed from the person I knew. I wonder what the real Alidoro was like. Thing to let go, never getting the chance to know the real hero. He died so suddenly. How sad. I don't know what happened, but I hope it was painless and he's at peace. Thanks for finding out about his death. Here's a gift. Always welcome, friends. May I be of service? Que bello! A brand new design. No, a whole new model. What a thrill! And there we are. Done. Even a brand new model doesn't stand a chance when you're dealing with genius. But the device bordered on genius itself. Required all my intellect. If you ever meet the creator, get me their calling card, won't you? No, oh, sorry, I'm sure you're busy. Just let me know if you ever find out. House of Vanini, even priceless things have a price. Every item is a treasure of distinguished quality and superior provenance. Ah, Master Vanini's collection box. You have been busy, sir. The House of Vanini deals only in masterpieces and works of special genius, sir. And I'm pleased to say that for you, the private reserve is open. At the House of Vanini, even priceless things have a price. Every item is a treasure of distinguished quality and superior provenance.
total attack. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood, the Fox, the Cat, and Alidoro, too. I don't even want to guess what they might be planning, pal. This way must lead to their headquarters, shall we? Resembles. Yes, it seems we can use it to call a submarine. 